Hi, in this video you'll see some details about the electrohydraulic pump used by Toro 270 for lifting and lowering the cutting deck. The hydraulic pump is made by Oildyne model 108, which is different compared to the one put on the Toro's younger brother 268. This one uses a complete system, pump, two hydraulic hoses and a cylinder. The reason for disassembling the pump was because it didn't make any sound and wasn't moving at all. And here you can clearly see the reason why it wasn't working. After cleaning and lubricating the motor was working properly. Then I removed the oil pump reservoir to check the oil level and quality and this is what I found. Pink liquid and foam which means that water leaked into the hydraulic system. The Toro part number for this pump is 94-1700 and for the cylinder it's 94-1701. The pump capacity is 0.4 liters or 12.5 ounces not including the hoses or the cylinder and the output is rated at 0.9 liters or 0.23 gallons per minute at 500 psi or 34 bar. This pump has both pressure and thermal relief valves to protect it from overload. The thermal relief valves are not adjustable and are set approximately 500 psi or 34 bar higher than the circuit relief valves. It has a low pressure port rated at 400 psi or 27.2 bar and high pressure port rated at 1000 psi or 68 bar. And here we are, everything clean and ready for refill. The manufacturer recommends Dexron type 2 or type 3 oil. And it's time to perform some tests. For this procedure I'm using a 12 volt 7 amps battery and some straps. If everything goes well, the hydraulic system should be able to easily lift and hold the front part of the mower. Now I'm reversing the polarity to check the other circuit. And one more lift. To me it looks good and sounds good too. Let's check the other circuit functionality. Yep, all good here too. So this is the hydraulic system used to lift any of the 38, 42, 48 or 52 inch cutting decks. Thanks for watching.